Welcome back to the channel. It's me, G, here alone doing a Wendy's review on the pretzel pretzel bun, bacon bun. I'm going to write it because I don't remember. Pretzel bacon and I got a double. Um, let me take a thumbnail. I think this side looks prettier. Ha! <sighs> let me try it. I put pickles. How is everybody doing? All right. Um, I got spicy nuggets on the side with a little Asian zing as my sauce because they didn't give me my ranch, but it's okay because this is actually probably better. I got... A little story time. I got Wendy not only because I wanted to try this uh, Red Reggie Bush. Well, at least in the commercials, they say the Reggie Bush. Um, if you know, you know. Like I said, I'll write down. Um, it's called the pretzel bacon. I know it has onion. I don't know what it's called. And I got a double. And it tastes good. Like, really good. It has, like, I don't know what kind of cheese. It looks like Munster because of the red part or orange part. I didn't want to hold you too long in my story. I want to see if I can say it. They didn't give me napkins either. One of these do better. They never do better. So, if you follow me on Instagram, Michi85 on Instagram, today I posted, well, last night at 12, I posted two pictures of um, my deceased boyfriend that I had a relationship with, and I would have still probably had a relationship with. Um, because like, that was the, the love of my life. I wouldn't have done anything for that man. Um, when I was 18, uh, you know, I experienced death um, due to gang, vi not gang, because he wasn't in a gang, gun violence. Gun violence. Uh, we were sitting in the car, uh, parked in front of his house, a little in front of his house, and we were eating Wendy's. And it was hot, and he was happy about it. And I always will remember the fact that that night, he was happy that his Wendy's was hot, and it was on point, right? And you see, this is why I don't like really talking about it, and I don't wanna be vulnerable. Um, it's been 18 years. I know he is resting peacefully. Um. And I just want to deter away from that moment to the fact that it not only happened to him, it happened to me. I was in the car with him. Um, luckily, he was like my savior and I reacted very well. As soon as I seen the opportunity to react, I reacted instead of yelling or being paranoid um a guy you know like i don't want to talk about the situation technically but um we were in the car a uh, gunman came and basically shot at the car at both of us i stood up and left that situation with no scratches on my body um and at that point i became a suspect and not a victim um he was he he was uh taken to the hospital um still talking still trying to survive uh and i was at some point taken by the cops in the backseat of their car for questioning 
Um, I was questioned by, I don't even know how many detectives I was questioned by. Um, before I realized that, you know, because I was going to school and I was in college for com criminal justice, where then I started realizing after I like stopped crying and stopped, you know, wanting to plead that somebody take me to see him. Somebody, ta I never asked for my mom. I kept on just saying, can you guys take me to go and see him? Why am I still here? Why am I in this room? All to find out that I was the suspect. I was never a victim. Even though I was in the car, I got shot at as well. <laughs> I got shot at as well, officers. He just saved me. He gave me a armor. He put his whole body in front of the window to cover me. And I reacted by jumping out the car. Because if I didn't, then I would have gotten shot or, you know... I just reacted. I jumped out the car and took cover. And I could replay the whole scene, the whole scenario over and over again. I became a, I became a suspect for a while. I'll tell you that. To his mom, to his grandma, um... I was with him for two years. And then um, a little bit, I dated him in sophomore year for a little bit, but he was on his own because he was a senior. He was on his own stuff, but he came back. He realized what he was missing, you know? So we, when we rekindled, um, we re we rekindled hard, you know? That was my man's. Even though we were young, we were like that young love. I was still in high school, but he was out of high school. Um, he was going to be, he was going for automotive. Um, I didn't go away for college because of him. I wanted to stay near him. I wanted to be around him. Uh, but I became a prime suspect. And it didn't help that three months later, because this happened in September, September 20th, um, 2004. Three months later is my birthday, November 16th. And Anaya's dad, who was in the streets, knew about it because he was in the, the block I was from, you know, where I grew up at my whole life. Um, he heard about it. He knew about it. He was my friend who I used to cop from. Um, he knew about it, but, you know, not that he never wanted to do anything, but I never did anything with him, but... Him knowing about it, he took a... It was my birthday. I decided to do something that, you know, kids, teenagers do when they're fucked up in the head. And that's how Anaya's here. Um, I really didn't have a relationship with her father. I had a friendship with him. I never planned on getting um, pregnant. It was just a one-night thing for my birthday. Three months after experiencing this with Ivan. Uh... And that's too much info. And don't come for me in the motherfucking comments because I don't give a shit. Uh, I'm just, you know, opening up a little bit. Uh, yeah. The story is like, could go everywhere. I could give more details on details. I just wanted to... Um, 18 years later... I will always feel feel the pain. Um, and remember it no matter what. Like, I think my body remembers it even if my, uh, I don't look at the dates or anything. I just already know I'm in a shitty mood or I'm in a mood and I don't want to cry right now. Um, it's been a long time and it will always you know you you never forget you could store it in your heart as a memory but i would love i would give anything to like hear his voice one last time and that's why um you you should appreciate um the people you have in your life because you never know. Make the memories. And I, I didn't come on here to cry. I came here for the...
pretzel bun review for wendy's the fact that he ate wendy's um and he was happy that day and you know to state that we have i have accomplished a few of the goals that we spoke about wanting to accomplish together um i've accomplished it on my own uh, i'm still here fighting and being strong and at one point even if people thought i was a suspect or my actions um didn't show how i felt about him i don't have to explain that shit to no one um and you never know how you will feel experiencing the situation like i was a victim and nobody even acknowledged that you know i could have been dead with him because i wanted this to be happy just remembering moment of him um and to to let people know to love your loved ones while they're here and make memories and take pictures and photos and videos and just love on each other now because you never know what will happen what will the situation be um yeah but um he's he's i know he's looking over me and i think i've might have done some dumb shit in the process but i still think that i have made him proud and you know my bad <laughs> i just i don't like being vulnerable and i don't like being um emotional and i know it's not good to not be Oh my puppy no. He was a very gorgeous, smart, ambitious man. And um I will always remember him and the experiences we had together. Um you know, the young love, that was, if they say you only get three, that was for sure my first love. My first true love would have been him. I won't take back my babies or the everything I've experienced since then, but what I would give just to hear his voice. And I'm gonna let you guys go with that because I, I don't know if I could keep on. And it's crazy how, you know, cops work. They just wanna close the case. No matter what, they'll put two together and be like, yeah, that has to be because of that. Um, Ivan's shooter, his mom did not rest um he is in jail um for 50 years and he was sentenced in 09 i believe i was pregnant with my son when he got sentenced but um yeah she she his mom will not rest until you know because they left it they left it for a like they made it a cold case for a while but she did not rest she re she made the the tv she contacted the the spanish news station and made it reappear because she was not going to rest until she found out who did it and i'm glad she did and he's in jail um but yeah um i know i don't and I don't know how much I could edit to not make it as sad. I didn't want this video to be sad. I wanted it just to say like the happy things that has. I can't 
All right, um, my, I popped on my contact. I'm not gonna be able to do my ending to state exactly the video, what the video is for, besides recognizing, recognition to him, um, and the fact that you will always be in my heart. I do not have to justify who you were to me. If you knew me, you knew um, how much he meant to me. Um, and no matter what, I don't hate anyone for how they felt at the time. And um, it is what it is at this point. You know, it's 18 years later. Even if it was three years later, um, I grew and I noticed things, but it didn't matter. You know, it didn't matter. I can't change how you feel because of decisions I made or even if I didn't make no decisions, just from how you felt. It was how you felt. I hope you know, I know you are resting in peace and I know you're watching over me and I hope I have made you proud. You will always be part of my heart and I am content with living now without fear um, that something might happen to me uh, I do sometimes still get scared being parked in the car too long but that's just a thing that I don't think I will ever let go but that's just something you're aware of more you know you you're aware of stuff but I don't move as often and I'm good and I am who I am bye um a little soft a little softy vulnerable meet you right here um sorry and I don't know how much I could edit it to make sense but this was for him and for me as well.